Hi everyone, this is my first video for my final year project. First I introduce myself, I am Hussain. I am following BSc Computer Systems and Networking at Curtin University. This video is for Computer Technology Project 1 module. In this video, I am going to talk about wireless stethoscope to facilitate real-time monitoring operation. In this video, I am going to talk about some important points of my project. We will move to next slide. These are the contents that I am going to talk about in this video. Introduction Methodology How I am going to implement this project Internet of Things Simply we say IoT. What is an IoT and advantages and disadvantages of IoT. Introduction Each year there are a huge amount of people people dies because of heart attack and most of patients dead out of hospital while their day to day activities like working and playing. Normally doctors channeling a patient in hospitalized environment. But if it possible to channel a patient in real normal environment that is better than hospitalized environment. For example, if a patient is a player, then doctor can channel that patient while he is in action. He is better than previous one. In this project, I am trying to develop a stethoscope that enables doctors to channel a patient while patient were in patient were in real environment. We are they were in. Even doctors can channel them remotely. To make it possible, I am going to use IoT. We will look about IoT in my next slides. Let's we look methodology. In this simple scenario, I have mentioned that how this stethoscope is going to work. Initially, stethoscope connected to access point to access the internet. Patients have the wireless stethoscope. It reads the body vibration and convert it into data and sends through the internet to the specific receiver. Through the receiver, Doctors hear the body vibration sound. We will discuss this methodology deeper in my next videos. Internet of Things What is an IoT? There are a lot of definitions for IoT. Simply we can say connecting devices or object using internet in other ways representing an object digitally with the use of internet to make it possible engineers uses sensors embedded systems and smart objects etc using iot objects can communicate each other without help of humans and objects can be monitored and managed remotely. There are some communications types in IoT. Those are people to people, machine to machine and machine to people. We will move to next slide. In this slide
these are some advantages and disadvantages of an IoT. Advantages are communication. It allows machine to machine and machine to people and people to people communications. Second, automation and control. Faster analysis than the humans. Third one, monitor. Accuracy of data because of using sensors. Fourth one, time saving. Save time since this is automated. Disadvantages are complex systems. Hard to develop. Failures can occur. Second one, data security and privacy. Data violation, spoofing, passive listener problems are there since using internet. Third one, safety. Intruders can hack the system and modify the system. These are the references I have used. From here, we wind up this session. We will take a deep look about this project in my next videos. Thank you.